Today I'm going to make chia gel and chia seeds are what chia seeds and water is all that you need to make chia gel and today I'm going to show you how to make chia gel the only things you need to make chia gel are chia seeds and water so really quick on chia seeds they are tiny little seeds that are high in omega-3 they're smaller than a sesame seed but they absorb nine times their um, weight when they're exposed to other liquids or to liquids so one of the reasons why you might want to make chia gel is if you're making a smoothie and you want to make it a little bit thicker um, then the chia gel will help make that happen and it's obviously a vegan and a raw solution to um, thickeners so I've put one cup of water in here and then I'm going to put two uh, tablespoons or two scoopfuls of the chia seeds <coughs> Now you can get chia seeds at Costco. I got these at CVS. I'm a crazy couponer and I'll include a link to my guide to couponing so that you can learn how to get these for free. But these were $16.99 at CVS in um, it's December 2012 as I'm videoing this and um, I got them for free from couponing. So they're not expensive for me. Okay, so you add all of your chia seeds to the water, and then what you want to do is stir them so that they don't stick together. Um, stirring them can be done with a fork, with a whisk, but um, if you do it with a fork, just do a whisking type motion to um, keep them from sticking to one another, and that will help them absorb um, water more quickly. And they need about 15 to 30 minutes to... Um, start absorbing the water and turning into a gel. So I'm going to unload the dishwasher and then I will come back and show you what this looks like once it's turned in. Okay, so it's been about 20 minutes and our chia gel is all ready to go. Um, I'll show you. So the fork I've just left in there and you can see that it has really turned into a gel. So that's all you need to do to um, make chia gel. And I um, actually am gonna throw it in a smoothie today um, in the Vitamix and this will just help it um, the smoothie be a little thicker and smoothier, if that's a word. If you have any questions, please don't hesitate to ask. Thank you so much for watching and we will see you next time. Oh, and if you like this video, please give it a thumbs up. That helps us continue growing our YouTube channel and allows us to share more videos like this one with you.